This is a video walkthrough of 4235 Lanai. We're located here in Lake Sarasota. Um, this is an auction property going to auction on Thursday. Uh, pretty quiet street here. It's uh, The houses around are, are pretty nice. Um, this house isn't bad as far as uh, hub zoo auctions go. I'm not crazy about this um, little courtyard and arch thing here. That's just kind of ugly, I have to say. I don't know what to do about it. The roof is... Um, the roof is in okay shape. I'm, I'm, believe it or not, for once in my life looking at these houses, I'm gonna say it doesn't need a roof. Um, Cause my, my pretty much mantra is that everything needs a roof. I gotta say, this one might have some life left in this roof. Okay, this is, um, you know, three, two split plan. And of course I walk in and see a big, a big wall here in, that's a purposeless closet. So you have this closet that you're, I mean, it's so silly that they do this. And so many times we take this wall out and open this up and it's so much nicer. So I'll start right here in this living room. We have an odd angle there that separates the kitchen. And what am I gonna say? Let's open it all up. This is a perfect opportunity to do that. However, I have to say, the kitchen isn't bad. I mean, they actually have granite along this wall. Um, you know, the cabinets are, I mean, this kitchen was updated. These are actually relatively nice cabinets and granite. There's even stainless appliances in here. I don't know. I, I would, of course, like to see it opened up, but it's a little, it's nicer than, than normal. So, so not bad for an auction. It actually smells pretty good in here. I don't like the carpet in this room, but it is pretty clean. The tile's pretty ugly, but I gotta say, it's, it's not terrible. This is the master bedroom, and even this color isn't too offensive, and this carpet is in very good condition. The kitchen, or the kitchen, the, the shower here, um, Looks like, I mean, it, it just needs to be cleaned up. The tile's actually not bad. Vanity's ugly, but a little bump out window here, kind of put plants on, that's kind of cool. We do have a broken window here, it's been boarded up. Uh, so some hurricane damage occurred here, and I can see there's a good sized tree that has fallen down, and a branch that took out part of the fence there. So actually we have two big trees that are down. In fact, let's take a look at these things. Oh, I see. Looks like that tree took out that roof over here, which is being fixed at the moment. Um, wow, these are some big, big root damage, big tree damage that uh, came down. So pretty much fell on that house. That's being repaired. Well, that's a big tree. Big root system. Hmm. It's too bad. So that's going to have to be taken care of. I mean, it's not going to cost too much, but it has to be chopped up and hauled away. Um, see all the junk on the flat roof here. It looks like uh, some branches did come down and bend up the flat, flat roof. But pretty much this roof remained unscathed and looks to be in okay condition. Obviously, we're going to need to fix the fence. So, love the uh, faux brick painted, <laughs> someone put some effort into that, but I think we're going to get rid of that. Um, this painted concrete here, this head carpet at one time that was glued down, I can see the residue, and then it was painted with a speckly outdoor paint, which was a good move. Um, going through the kitchen again, power's not on, otherwise I'd... I would um, would have the lights on. This little root, this is a little, uh, I guess, uh, breakfast nook. We're gonna call it. It's not a dining room, but it's a, a breakfast area. That, I mean, it's 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 okay. It's kind of odd that that walks into this room, which is not a bedroom because it does not have a closet. So this, I guess, would be a den. Um, out onto the lanai, not bad. And then over here we have two bedroom and a bath. 
So this is actually a three bedroom plus a den, two bath. Um, real artist. Some real art artists in, lived here apparently. This bathroom, you know, could be updated. It's not terrible, I'm seeing worse. I'm, I'm surprised this carpet is in such con good condition. The AC unit out there looks um, pretty good. It's a big AC, it's a big train, which is nice. Hey, you know, paint and this would, wouldn't be too bad. Probably scrape the ceiling and take the popcorn off. Kind of odd that that angle is like that here. And then we have, of course, plastic stuff on the ceiling and fluorescent lights, which can easily be taken down. Then I walk in here. This is the air conditioning system. Yeah, I gotta say, this is in really good condition. That's a newer AC. That's, that's great. No roof, no AC. You, 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 that's really good. Um, garage is nice. Nice and big, I have to say. Panel looks good. A little workshop out here. This is a big garage. Garage door has seen better days. I'm gonna say this this really could be changed out. Um, you know, the new ones are all reinforced. Water heater looks pretty good. Um, yeah, so mechanically, this house is pretty good. So the auction ends on, on Thursday. I gotta do the comps, but um, I'm relatively impressed by this, by this uh, place. I mean, you really could clean it up and just move in without a major project. Even the ceiling fan's pretty nice. So that's where we're at, Jules Roman, Yorkshire International, 941-366-0000. And as always, thanks for watching.